Okay guys, here are the ribbons that we're going to be working with for our cupcake hair bow. We're going to be using some cupcake printed ribbon, of course, 7 8 inch. I've got some hot pink and white dot, 7 8 inch. I've got shocking pink and white dot, 1 and a half inch. I've got hot pink, and I've got this aqua color. And again, all the tutorials that we will be using in this video, as well as the ribbon location where you can actually get the ribbon, will be uh, down below in the description box. Again, this is just another design idea. If you need the tutorials, check the description box. And we're going to transform these ribbons into this. you can see we have completed all four parts we have our pinwheel which I'm going to use as the base we have two sets of spikes and then the twister topper is going to go on top now we're just going to layer everything together and the layer process I'm using today pinwheel on bottom followed by our big set of pinwheels pinwheel version 2 that is or spikes whatever you call them then we're going to layer our second uh, set of pinwheels on top and then on the very top is the twister topper. Let's go ahead and put it together. Okay guys, here's the finished bow ready to be worn by your little cupcake. See how cute that ribbon is? I love the colors. And this one was very simple. Again, I'm all about the simple. But you know what? While the cupcake print ribbon is cute, on its own, I'm needing a little bit more. Yeah, more cupcakes, says the girl with the big thighs. But don't worry, because these cupcakes are, are fat free, right? Can have as many as we want. I think we need more cupcake. So I'm going to show you how to make the cupcake and we're going to place it on top. You're going to need brown one and a half inch ribbon. You're going to need an alligator pinch clip. I'm working with two pieces of corker ribbon. And what you do with your brown is you're going to need to cut a four inch strip like this. This is going to be our cupcake base. To make the base, we're just going to fold it in a circle like this. And you want to glue where the two pieces come together. So just add your glue right here. And then you're going to take it and you're going to press it down flat. And again, just add some glue right on the edges so it stays down. So go ahead and do that. Okay, do you see how flat we made it? Now, I'm going to take the two corners here and I'm going to tuck them under and add a little glue just right here just tuck them under because we want this to look like uh, the bottom of a cupcake so go ahead and take your ends and tuck them under see the bottom it looks more like a cupcake bottom now we're just going to add the topping 
or the top. We are going to take two 12 inch pieces of corker ribbon. Again, the uh, tutorial for corker ribbon is going to be in the descriptions box. We're also going to get a piece of felt, cut it in a circle. Now it doesn't matter what color felt you're using. If it doesn't match, that's fine because this is not going to show. Now what we're going to do is I'm going to take my two pieces of corker ribbon and I'm going to wrap it around this felt piece and glue it on. You might want to go ahead and add your glue to your felt and then just start, you know, wrapping the ribbon around. And you can do one piece at a time or you can put both pieces together, but you just want these on the round circle. And this is what it's going to look like once you start wrapping it. And be sure just, just a little glue will be fine, just long enough where it stays where it's at. And just keep going around until you're done. And I'm going to add the pink right here in the middle. Here's the top to my cupcake. I have wrapped all my corkers around the felt. And I'm ready to glue this to our cupcake base. You can put your cupcake on your clip. Or just glue it to the top of your hair bow. Pretty cute. I've added my cupcake to the middle of my cupcake bow. I just slid the alligator clip in between my center. And I added a um, little pom-pom, red pom-pom for the cherry. And if you've got some seed beads or some tiny beads, you can also add those to make it look like your cupcake has sprinkles. But there it is, our cupcake hair bow and clip.